makeup. Amazing. I love her videos and her vlogs are so, so cute. Hey guys, good morning. It's like a good afternoon actually. Um, I just put a little bit of makeup on and I'm about to, I need to do my hair. I'm about to film the summer must-have tag that was created by, um, who created it? Um, but it um bum bum. I can't think of who created it. Oh, Rach Loves and Check in the Mirror, which are both Rachel's. And I'm watching Kiss and Makeup's vlog. I love her. She is like seriously the sweetest freaking girl in the entire world. She lives in Miami, so we're definitely gonna hang out. Oh, don't mind my voice as well. I feel like I'm getting a cold. I was coughing all night last night, and I don't know what it was. I mean, I know that you don't get colds from, like, cold water, like, going swimming in cold water. But, I don't know, maybe I just have been, you know, it didn't help my immune system. I don't know, a lot of traveling and whatnot. But I got my flu shot, so I don't think it's the flu. It might just be, like, a minor cold, um, which kind of stinks. But, hopefully I get through it. Um, I'm just kind of a little <clears throat> under the weather. I painted my nails last night. It's um, Aquadelic by China Glaze. It's just a teal blue. Yes, I'm going to go ahead and film. Bella's sleeping on the floor. What you doing, Slippy? I finally put all my clothes in my closet because I'm going to be here for so long and I'm going to need to pack, like, multiple times. So I finally just, like, undid everything from my suitcase and put it in my closet. And, um, so everything was out of my suitcases and Bella's been sleeping in my suitcases, so she's not happy about it. But I put down my old blankie so she can still sleep on it. <clears throat> One is. So this is a park right by my house. I used to come here all the time when I was younger with all my friends. Um, it's called Trestle Park. Bell's seeing what she can get, but that's what it looks like. They put up a new dock, which is really nice. But it's just a little green, a little lake. It's kind of big, but it's a nice little super relaxing place. And I like to take care of Bella here because she can just hang out and roam around. Yay! It's so nice out. Perfect day for a walk. Well, night for a walk. Even though it's kind of icky out, but... That's a New York for you. Hey guys, so I really quickly just wanted to hop on here and tell you something because my mom just showed me this, um, that she had had this and that one of her friend's sons is selling it or something like that and I just tried it for the first time tonight on my skin. It's called the Neurum AD Age Defying Treatment. It comes in a box like this. I was reading reviews online because my mom was like, do you want to try it? And I did try it. I have it on tonight. It's really tightening and... I read a lot of reviews online about it, and they say it's really drying, um, but it's supposed to be really good for itch spots, wrinkles, just kind of overall the texture of your skin for your pores breaking out, all that kind of stuff. It's supposed to be really good for it. So, yeah, I'm trying it and seeing, but I've wondered if any of you else have tried this before, and you can kind of give me feedback, but I read reviews online and people either hated it or absolutely loved it. It is really, really pricey. I want to say this bottle is like $85 or something like that. Um, it's 30 ounces, and they say you go through about one a month. But I just want to know what all the hype is about. So if you've tried it, let me know. Hey, guys. So I am editing a video, a fashion video that I just did. Um, so I've been kind of a lame blogger, vlogger. But, yeah, the lighting is super weird in this room. I'm editing a maxi skirt dress fashion video. And I wanted to tell you guys really something exciting. I know you guys know that I work for the brand Hollister. Well, I got an email, like an inbox message on my YouTube account from Gilly Hicks, which is their lingerie line. They're like girls only type of line. And um, I I only buy their bras and underwear and stuff like that. I love it. Absolutely love it. And they asked me if I'd be interested in, you know, doing stuff like that for them. And I'm like, oh my God, they're like, we watch your videos. We love them. And I was like, how exciting that I work for that company. And they, you know, reached out to me. So I'm really excited to work with them. Um, you guys definitely should check them out. I'm going to be, they're going to be giving me gift cards and stuff like that to give you guys and promo codes and things like that. So 
if you guys buy your bras from Victoria's Secret, definitely check out Gilly Hicks. It's a really awesome brand. I only wear their stuff. And, um, yeah, it's like you, they're kind of pricey if they're full price, but they always have deals going on and stuff like that. So you always can get them way affordable and they last forever and they're so stinking cute. So yeah, I'm just really excited about that. And here's a sneak peek on my fashion video, which you'll already see before this goes up. Finally there's sunshine and the puppies seem very happy about it. I'm hoping that the sun kind of changes and starts to set over here because I'd like to film a video over here today. So it's nice and sunny and pretty. Hopefully. Good morning. So, I still feel really sick, congested ickiness. Um, but I am going to hop in the shower and get ready for the day. It's so nice out and I'm so excited for finally a nice day. Hey guys, so I'm attempting to film outside today. I'm wondering if it's the best, it's best if I'm both dark and both dark. I don't know. Anyways, I'm attempting to film outside today. Oh, see if I'm in the shade and the things in the shade too, but I have the sun from that. Looks kind of good. Anyways, um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm attempting to film my what's in my beach bag video outside. And it's, it's actually quite hot out today, but it's so nice out. Let me show you in my backyard. That's a big old tree. And that's a lawn chair. And that's my mom's garden. And all that is just land. Land, land for days. The odds are seriously against me in filming today, I swear. Because as soon as I'm like all set up, ready to go, a four-wheeler from next door decides to ride around. And he'll be back, I'm sure. He's been riding in the backyard. He'll be back, I can hear him. I just can't get a break. What are you doing, Snoopy? What are you doing, Isabel? Isabel, Isabel, Isabel. Sophia, Isabel, Isabel is hiding under the chair. It's hot. Isabel, is it hot? Is it hot, little monkey? Hey guys, so I'm filling out some things for um for my doctor's appointment tomorrow. I have to like print out paperwork or whatever. But I wanted to tell you, so I'm like filming outside, and my mom comes home, and there's a cop that follows her into the back of follows the back of her. And I guess there's been some recent burglaries around my area and she knows about it. And um, she like knew of them because obviously it's a small town, everybody talks. And so the cop was like asking her questions because I guess the car that is involved in these burglaries looks just like my mom's car, which is very strange. It's like a Cadillac, but it's like chocolate brown and has a tan hood. So it's like very different. And my mom got it from, well, my dad actually got it from my mom from Florida like a couple years ago. So... It's like very odd, not a very, you know, it's a pretty unique looking car. And so he was like, oh gosh, here comes the state trooper. They're going to take pictures of my mom's car, like, because they keep asking her questions and stuff and they think it's her, but she's not, obviously. But they think it might be somebody else, like my brother or something, so. But it's not, obviously. It's a spy. Shh, be very quiet. Hey guys, so I just finished filming like three videos, heck yeah, um, which is good because I'm going to need videos for um, when I go visit Mike next week to just have like uploaded and whatnot, so exciting stuff, be excited for those vlogs, I'm excited to go visit him, yay! Bella, you give me that ball, come here, Soph. Sophia, give it to me. Sophia, you got to give it to me. Give it to me. Drop it. Sophia, out. Sophia. Oh, you little beast. Bella, get that ball. Get it, Bella. Get it. Get it, Bella. Get it in. Oh, there it is. Give me that ball. You give it to me. Good girl. Give it to me. Ready, is? Ready, is, Bella? You ready? Go get it, is. Good girl. Bring it to me. Bella's being very beasty. She doesn't share well. Come on, Izzy, you give me the ball. Don't be growly. I have a sleepy little baby here. Oh, the sleepiest baby. I painted her toenails. Can you see him? Eat berries in the canaries, but I'll be I. Very excited about it. She's going to just, like, pass out. She's been on and off sleeping here. Hi, for spending FaceTiming with Mike and watching Breaking Amish. I'm coming on my little garbage. Her so sleepy and cute. She's so cute and she's baby. I love her. What? Looks too small for your face. Yeah. 
are? Yeah. I don't like them real big. These are velvet. Velvet? Yeah, they're velvet. Oh, what do you think? Retro. Oh, it's a clock going off. Yeah. Do you know this train used to carry like stuff that was um, talk like nuclear? I don't know that. I read it somewhere. Or maybe I just heard it. Or maybe it's a lie. I don't know. I did hear it. But if it ever knocked it over, it was bad. Well, it's kind of fun to watch trains. I used to hate getting stuff behind this. Never for school, though. I wouldn't get stuck behind a train for school. No. But I'd get stuck behind... Oh, for work. For going to Andrews. No, for going to work. Yum. I'm so excited to try these. Oh, I could win a One Direction concert ticket. No cookie for you. No cookie for both of you. Go win more on birthday. Jeanette. Why do you still like such a strange puppy dog? You're not puppy. What are you doing? That can't be good for your tailbone. What's wrong, turkeys? What are you doing? Close your legs, Sophia. Close your legs, Sophia. Hey guys, so I just wanted to share with you a quick little um, thing that I'm actually working on right now. First of all, I got my hair even more ombre today. I know you can't see because the lighting is super bad. Well, you can kind of see it. No, you can't see. The lighting is really bad because. Let me turn around this way. I wonder if you can kind of see it. No. Anyways, um, so I was like reading a bunch of stuff on my skin because I really feel like my skin is just not what it should be for how much I like really take care of my skin. Like it's not as good as it should be. And I just suffer from, and even my brother pointed out the other day, he's like, yeah, you don't have bad skin. It's just like right around this area. You just have a lot of like bumps and like little breakouts. And I'm like, yeah, you know, that's weird. And I did hear from, um... Bob's Beauty, she did like a face map thing. Like if you have breakouts here, it pertains to something that's attached to your organs, that's attached to your body. And um, I read on multiple things today online that um, clogged pores and stuff like that, breakouts around the nose, can be related to allergies. So um, I've been, and I have been noticing that I've kind of been kind of congested and, my, and I thought I had a cold, but my mom's like, maybe it's allergies. Like you have dry cough, you know, all that kind of stuff. So I started taking Benadryl this morning, and then this is my second pill today. Sorry, it's like so red. Um, so hopefully, if that's the case, that'll be such an easy fix is to just take some um, allergy pills. But I might need to like get allergy shots if I have like really bad allergies or something like that. My friend Bridget has horrible allergies, but I'm hoping that maybe this will kind of help me. So if you guys suffer from like just like kind of like swollen, inflamed, clogged pores right here. Um, try Benadryl. I'll let you guys know how I think, of course. In my, I'm going to be doing an updated skincare routine shortly, so I will definitely um, put these in if it does something for me. Good morning. I have two crazy puppies next to me this morning. Two of them. Oh, I'm so congested and stuffy. I think I do have allergies. Blech. My thanks, Nopia. You think the beep, snow beeps, snow beeps, snow beeps. Oh, what? <laughs>
garbage picker. Yep. Pretty. Happy birthday. Set off somebody's alarm. Hey, geek. Where are them onions from? You get Lindy some caramel corn so she can fall asleep on it again. Oh, and put it on her back. <laughs> you should take a picture and send it to her. Ryan. Go touch. His eyes are blinking. Look at him. It is real. Look at the chain in his head. No, he's not. Oh my god, is he really? Yeah, he is. I just saw him swallow. Of course. Go take a picture of him. I was in bed as soon as I got home. I was so tired. said you came and watched We pulled up on the way home. We were on our way back through. It was a decent show. I don't see any milk cans, though. Come on, get them. Come on, I want Jose Jalapeno. Bounce it off the monkey. Come on, get some orders. Hold the monkey. This is where I'm going to go. Play. Ivory. Oh. Who's got the ivory tower? Anybody? No, ivory. Oh, I want to see him go. Get the rat out of the box. Why is this woman wearing like Look at the rat. He's still back up. Where do you go? He's in the ivory. There he is. It's like whack-a-mole. 10 to 1. That's pretty dumb. 
Remember Ivory? There he is. Oh, little guy. All right. The more you cover, guys, the better your chances. Okay. All right. Here we go. Cheer him on, guys. Go, go, go. Feel it. Round and round and round he goes. Check it out. Where is he going to stop? Come on, buddy. Where are you going? He's <laughs> like, I don't know. It's Blue Stripes. Hey, Gee. I'm videotaping you. Don't forget. Come on, fling at me. Where'd it go?